Coming soon to video cassette. I am your son. This summer is about to get hotter. The smash box office hit is about to become the number one rental ever. Ransom. Give me two million dollars or you'll never see him again. Sean! Your only priority is getting your boy back. Ask the some sign that he's alive. Is he indoors? Is he outdoors? Oh, is that? How many kidnappings have you worked before? Ten. Got back seven. What went wrong? If I were a betting man, I would bet on the people who pay. Did you bet on the ones where you got back a corpse? Hello? They had him right where they wanted. Yeah, he hung up. You don't know where he is! You don't know where he is! You're the FBI and you don't know spot! Hey. Get him! Until he did. Is our son dead? Don't ever think that. What they never expected. Tom, you're on. The whole world now knows my son was kidnapped. This is what waits for the man who took him. This is your ransom. But this is as close as you'll ever get to it. Instead, I'm offering this money as a reward on your head. Take it back. No. Tell him that you were wrong. You think I don't want him back? You think I wouldn't do absolutely everything to get him back? Sean? I want to listen. Bell Gibson. I don't get my son back. I'm going to dedicate my life to tracking you down. Rene Russo. Who got shot? Gary Sinise. Delroy Lindo. Everybody, hold your fire! People Magazine calls it a slam-bang thriller. And Siskel and Ebert give it two thumbs up. It's the best film of the year. You still have a chance to do the right thing. If you don't, then God be with you because nobody else on this earth will be. I want to talk! You kill him! You kill yourself! Ah! Give me back my son! For seven years, Josie Potenza had everything. Nothing I wouldn't do for you, baby. A privileged lifestyle. Make a wish. And a marriage that made it all possible. Mrs. Potenza? Yes? It's about your husband, ma'am. Can you think of anybody who would have benefited from this death? I think Jake killed Tony. He wanted Tony's wife. I can't play second best forever. He wanted Tony's money. It's not my style. In a world where nothing is what it seems. I don't want to have to kill you, but I will. Everyone is a suspect. Get the house, get the cash. Perfect solution. I mean, who had motive, baby? You or I? Smile, Jake. The police are taking your picture. He's going to say that I paid him to kill Tony. Did you? Oh my God. Now, only one person is guilty. Judge is not the type to commit murder. But everyone has a motive. He's gonna kill me, and he's gonna kill you. Halle Berry, the rich man's wife. Do I know you? I mean, where do I know you from? You ever been to the ha-ha hole? Oh, you're, you're a comedian. Yeah, it's a, you know, it's a dream, you know, it's a lot of hard work and travel, and uh, you get hotels, I have a new booking agent. I know where it is. Starbucks. You came in and asked me for an application. Mike Peters' career led him from New York to downtown Hollywood, forcing him to leave behind his college sweetheart. Message one. You gotta get that girl out of your head. Uh, two. Did she call yet? Now, six months later, he can't get work, and he still hasn't gotten a date. I've been out of the game for so long, man. Her style was successful, good-looking cat. The ladies want to love you, Mike. You just gotta love it. So his best friend, Trent... I'm getting vibe like in a really weird way here. You want to play fun little games? Come on, you nasty little cute little baby. What are you doing? And all his buddies up, are taking charge of his love life. I don't can't think you know what you're doing. Where do the high school girls hang out around here? Go, daddy -o! And with friends like these, watch where you're going. That's oh, sure to mean trouble. Come on, man! Oh, Didn't you see boys in the hood? Not one of us is gonna get shot. Hi, this is Nikki. Leave a message. Hi, uh, Nikki, this is Mike again. I, I just called because it sounded like your, your machine might have cut me off when I... I don't want you to be the guy in the PG-13 movie everyone's really hoping makes it happen. I want you to be like the guy in the rated R movie. There's nothing wrong with letting the girls know that you're money and that you want a party. What do you drive? Uh, Cavalier. Ejected? Checked. Hi, this is Nikki. Leave a message. Anyway, I think that was, uh, weird and desperate. Dude, check it out, dude. I swear to God, it's on. Hi, Mike. Lorraine. Like the quiche. Miramax Films presents a comedy. Would you dance with me? With you, sure. I mean, if he 
Sure. About one normal guy pursuing true love in a world overflowing with attitude. So how long do I wait to call? A day. Tomorrow. Mm -mm. Tomorrow, then a day. So two days. Yeah, I guess you could call it that. Definitely. Two days. Two days is like industry standard. Swingers. Well, how long are you guys going to wait to call your babies? Six, Six days. Long ago, in the dark ages, there lived a mighty knight and his loyal servant, who had a little accident with a powerful wizard and a magic potion. Make that a really big accident. Now, they're in the 20th century. And if they don't destroy our world, they might just find a way back to theirs. Miramax Zoe is proud to present a film 900 years in the making. In the number one French comedy of all time, Jean Renault and Christian Clavier. The visitors. Pray they don't stay at your house. Emma was a matchmaker with the best of intentions and the most outrageous results. Good God. I see you've been hard at work. Now, romance is about to find her. I love John. Emma. I hate John. Mm -hmm. Newsweek calls Jane Austen's comedy fine, funny, and deeply charming. Time magazine says Gwyneth Paltrow brings elegance and class back to movie. <laughs> Emma. Try not to kill my dogs. Rated PG. Next time you're at a business meeting, try showing some cleavage. What? This is a man's world! Laurel Ayers was having a hard time making it in a man's world. Men like doing business with men. Sorry! Until she made up a man of her own. What's his name? Cuddy. 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 Cuddy? Is there a problem? <laughs> She's created an imaginary partner. Ah. Mr. Cuddy? No, he's in the bathroom. I'll take that, thank you. But she's doing all the work. I'm gonna go to with Cuddy. Call me. And he's getting all the credit. Without him, you're nothing. What are you going to do? I'm gonna perpetrate a great big whammy. I need the new look. Old and male. White. White? Academy Award winner, Whoopi Goldberg. My name is Robert Cuddy. Deeper! This fall, he is coming. The most successful man on Wall Street <laughs> is a woman. Ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Robert Cuddy. Oh, my God! Associate. Is Cuddy in? He's never in. This early. Rated PG-13. <laughs> Please welcome students from the Central Park East and River East Public Schools, the East Harlem Violin Program. From city streets to the world's greatest concert hall. I've never played on stage at Carnegie Hall. And we'll have gotten there at the same time. You can be nervous. I'm not nervous. Share the incredible journey that turns ordinary kids into musical, magical, small wonders. Okay, one, two, three. Here's the real Mr. Holland's opus, says the Boston Globe. It's the critically acclaimed, Oscar-nominated crowd-pleaser that's a must-see, raves the New York Daily News. Critics call it an uplifting story. I played on the same court as the Nick. It's going to be great. Share the joy. Congratulations. Oh, good. The struggle. The true life triumph of a remarkable teacher and her extraordinary small wonders. I'm going to tell my mom that I want to be in violin. And now, our feature presentation. <laughs> 